Greetings, good people. Hola, mi gente. I hope that everyone is fine and very, very, very well. My last video featured my, my big bro, my, my, my elder brother. Now, the truth is my twin brother is also my elder brother because he was born seven minutes before I was. He was born at 8.50 a.m. And I followed at 8.57 a.m. So he's my twin. I guess he's my big twin bro. And also my womb mate. Now, I was talking about my elder brother though. So I just briefly wanted to share this because uh, I think it's interesting. Uh, you might think it is as well. So I'm sharing about his name. My big bro's name, my elder brother's name, full name, is Arabron Odongo Ochieng Osanya Ninek. And growing up, I mean, I, I, I knew his name, but for short, we called him Rono. So as a little boy, I grew up referring to my elder brother as Rono. And then at a certain point, and this is many years ago, because I'm not super young, not, not as young as I look. In fact, the other day somebody told me, there's no way you're 50 yet. Why do you have all that gray hair? You're not yet 50. Somebody else, when I said that my son is 21 years old, said, there's no way. There's no way you're old enough to have a 21-year-old son. So anyway, I, I, I accept those as compliments. But back to the point, many years ago, decades ago, there was a celebrated Kenyan runner known as Henry Rono. Henry Rono was amazing. He was smashing world records in all sorts of long distance races. Uh, I don't remember exactly all the races, but I imagine it included the 5,000 meters, 10,000 meters. Uh, perhaps he did the steeplechase as well, uh, but he, he was incredible. Now, unfortunately for him, career wise, he was excellent at the time that uh, Kenya joined the US-led boycott of the Olympics that were held in Russia. So I think that was 1978. But, uh, you know, the US boycotted uh, those Olympics for political reasons. And then countries allied to the US also boycotted the Olympics. So Henry Rono, I don't think ever got to run in the Olympics. And, uh, but he was sensational. And, you know, growing up, I wasn't very aware of Kenyan uh, ethnic groups. I was semi-aware, but I wasn't very aware. So I knew that we were Luo. Okay, my father is Luo. Uh, now, my mother is from the U.S. So she's not Luo. She's many other things. Puerto Rican, German, Shinnecock. And uh, just downright cool. All right, so she's a lot of really nice things, but she's not Luo. And so perhaps because at that point in life, like early on, we were not living in Kenya. So, and I also was not surrounded by very many Kenyans. And then, you know, my mother was not Kenyan. So I wasn't fully aware of uh, Kenyan ethnic groups. 
But at one point, I guess I became aware that Henry Rono, this scintillating, legendary runner, was a Kalenjin. So I started wondering, okay, we are not Kalenjins. Henry Rono is a Kalenjin. So how is it that my elder brother and this celebrated runner have the same name? Rono. I was quite confused at that point. And so here's the story. My elder brother's name, as I said, is Arabron. And that's pretty well known. Uh, as I shared in my last video, he's a well-known actor in Kenya. And um, so he's known as Arabron, which makes sense because that's his name. He's known by his name. But guess what? As explained by my father, the name Arabron, you've probably never heard it anywhere else. Arabron. A-R-A-B-R-O-N. Arabron. Have you heard that name anywhere else? Do you know of anyone else with that name? Well, guess what? Arabron actually is a is a, is a mashup of Arab Rono, which is 100% a Kalenjin name. So my father, in naming my elder brother, in naming his firstborn son, now Rabron is a twin, okay? His twin is a sister, all right? So, but they're the first pair of twins. So he is the firstborn son to my father. All right. So anyway, my father in naming my brother Arabron was in effect naming him Arab Rono. And Arab Rono is a nickname that my father had garnered over the years. So that's my story. I just found it interesting, you know, as this little child, and I'm wondering, hey, my brother, we are calling him Rono. He's got the same name as this amazing athlete, yet the amazing athlete is a Kalenjin, and we are not. But that's the name I grew up calling my elder brother, Rono. And his name, Arabron, actually stands for Arab Rono. So I think that's pretty cool. But my elder brother, has a Kalenjin name. Now, even the name Yinek, which is not uh, unique to him, because that's our last name as a family. Actually, my father's last name is Osanya. And our clan name is Yinek. So my father decided to add our clan name to his last name and come up with a compound last name. Osanya Ninek. And then, as my father says, over the years at one point, a francophone person, a French speaker, spelt Ninek in the way that it's, it made sense to him as a French speaker. And so he came up with the spelling N Y Y N E with the accent aigu, Q-U-E. My father loved that spelling so much that he took that on. And so from initially having the last name Osanya, it morphed into Osanya Nyinek, and then spelling-wise, Nyinek became N Y Y. N E with the accent aigu, Q U E. And the end result is that my elder brother's name is Arabron Odongo Ochieng Osanya Ninek. Now, Odongo in Luo is a name for a second born male twin. So, as I mentioned, my elder brother and sister, they're twins. So, my sister was born first. And then five minutes later, my elder brother was born. So she's Apio, 
So in Luo, that's the name for a firstborn female twin. Then came my brother, so he's a secondborn twin and a male, hence the name Odongo. And then Ocheng references the time of day that he was born. And so similarly, my sister, who is called Apio, is called Acheng, all right? Because the two of them, of course, were born at the same time of the day. So I just wanted to throw that out there because I was thinking about my elder brother's name and I thought, how interesting. Again, thanks for taking these few minutes. Thanks for being interested and sharing the curiosity of some of the things that I put out there. I wish everyone the best always. Stay well and stay blessed.